This is Kaneohe Bay on the Hawaiian island of Oahu. In the middle of the bay is a tiny speck of land called Coconut Island. Once a playground for the rich and famous, this tropical paradise is now home to the Hawaii Institute of Marine Biology and base for Kim Holland's shark research. We're so fortunate here because our research lab is right in the middle of a bay which is one of the pupping grounds, the birthplaces for baby hammerhead sharks, where we can go very easily, right outside the door, catch some sharks, study them there in the open, or bring them back into captivity. So as far as a place to study hammerheads, there's no better place. Kim's team have discovered that there are up to 10,000 juvenile hammerheads living in the waters surrounding the island. What makes this place such a good shark nursery? At first, they wondered if the bay was rich in shark food. It turned out to be just the opposite. These shark pups aren't very well fed. The food resources in the bay really aren't that good. In fact, the baby hammerheads lose weight after they're born. And then after they figure out how to feed, then they start to get heavy again. It seems that these nursery grounds really have an anti-predation role. The bays here and all the bays that we know of around the world where these babies are born are pretty murky pieces of water. It's probably to help them hide and prevent them from getting eaten. 